if you ever need me. I'll be South Beach in the drop top kitty. Or the diamonds, aqua freely. Just need you in the blue bikini. Hey you guys, it's Johanna and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do a very simple prom look. So, I'm no longer in high school, so I can't do my own prom makeup, but I will be showing you guys. Okay, so I already went ahead and did my foundation. The foundation that I used is the Fit Me Foundation by Maybelline. And I always use this one. It's really cheap. You guys are looking for a good foundation for, you know, for prom so it can last the whole night. I feel like this would be fine. So, the first color I'm going to use for my eyeshadow I'm just going to go with the transition color. So I have this palette by Beauty Creations. I think it was like $15 or $20 around. I'm going to be using this one right here. They don't have names, so, you know, I can't tell you names. I feel like for this makeup look, you can literally grab anything that you have at home. It doesn't have to be exactly what I use, but just similar colors like... Transition shades. I'm sure all of your palettes probably have the one. The first brown that I'm going to be using is Mocha right here in the Jaclyn Hill palette. Once again, use any palette you have, any colors. Everything will work. So you see I'm making the shape of my crease. If it looks too harsh, you can always take a blending brush and, you know, start blending that out. Okay, so I just blended that color into my crease, and now we're going to be using the Stila um, Shimmer Shadow or Metallic Eyeshadow, whatever you guys call it. And this is expensive, obviously. It's $24. If you guys have it, use it. If not, just use like a shimmer shadow or anything that you guys have, maybe like the glitters from NYX. I'm going to be putting this like half of my lid. So I'm going to start right here and then end right here. So I'm not going to bring it out all the way. So just grab a little brush and then we're going to be grabbing a black color. So this one right here, wish me luck. And then we're just going to be kind of taking it. Also kind of applying it in the crease. Try to put a little bit so then we can blend it out. Now grab a blending brush and start blending that in. Now that I'm done with that part of my eyeshadow, I'm going to be grabbing a good like highlighting color to highlight my inner corners and then my brow bone. So I'm going to be using one of these. So the last thing we're going to be doing, we're going to be grabbing that transition shade color we got at the beginning. Or just like a softer brown. I'm going to put that in our waterline. It's just to give a little bit more color under the eye, but I don't want it to be so intense. Like I don't want to add black. So I'm just going to add this very subtle color. For the next step, we're going to be grabbing the Hoola Benefit Bronzing Powder. And we're kind of just going to bronze our face. So put it up here so you know your foundation blends in. Now that we're done with our eyes and we, we're done contouring, I'm going to be using the NARS concealer to use under my eyes. Since we are going to prom, I'm going to be baking today. So I'm going to grab the Cover Girl translucent powder. Don't judge me. I can't bake my face. I suck at it. But I get oily as heck. So if you guys have this problem, make sure to bake because your face is going to look super oily and nasty like at prom and you do not want that. Set our under eyes.
Then we're going to bake right here. And just because I get oily in my forehead, I'm just going to put a little bit of powder on my nose as well. Honestly, just everywhere. <laughs> I'm going to leave that on for a little bit. So after that, just grab a big brush and then just kind of brush the powder away. After baking, I'm going to be taking this Profusion blush. I don't really use blush, but I feel like for prom, I would want to use blush. And you guys would too, so just put that on your cheeks. That's cute, it adds like a little bit of, you know, redness to your skin. You know, you guys can use your favorite highlighter. The highlighter that I'll be using today is from the brand Cara, Cara, something like that. And it's not really showing up much because it's not a high-end brand or anything even close to a drugstore brand. So if you guys are going to prom, then I suggest you guys use a more intense highlighter. But since I'm not going, you know, I'm just going to leave it like that. See, that's why I don't like adding a contour or blush to my foundation because it brings out my scars a little bit more but I think it looks nice it looks good so far okay so now I'm done with my whole uh, face makeup so I'm gonna be applying these eyelashes I'm done putting on my eyelashes now it's time to do our lids so this is actually the color I use to go to my prom so I'm gonna be using this one but you guys can really use anything for this look like, I can put on a red lip. Like, let's say you're wearing a black dress and you really want to make, like, a statement. You can wear a red lip. Or you can wear more, like, a nude color. But I'm going to be trying this one out right now. I'm well, not trying it out because I already wore it, but I'm going to use this one. Just kidding. It's dry. So, I'm going to go for this color because that one's all dried. Okay, so this is the final look. I think it turned out really nice. I really like the shimmery color. And you know what? Excuse the eyelashes because I cannot put eyelashes on myself. Like, I can put them on other people. But when it comes to doing it on myself, it just, I do them so bad. But, you know, don't mind that. So if you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And please don't forget to subscribe. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and you guys love how my makeup turned out because I really love it. I think it's one of my favorite looks that I've done so far on my channel. So I hope that you guys really enjoyed this video and thank you guys so much for watching and see you guys next time. Without you.